Hi team, this is Coach Lucas. We're gonna be doing Pilates Athletic. With this workout, we're gonna be focusing on strength. The entire body needs to be challenged in ensuring you're able to get stronger. Let's get started. Team, let's position ourselves in such a way that we are nice and comfortable, core braced in, feet nice and wide, sitting down, focusing on a little bit of breathing and coming up. Exhaling out as you push your arms forward and coming back in again. Exhaling out, coming back, and again. Get your mind ready for what we're gonna be doing and try to focus. Push your hands out to the sides and come back in. And again, pushing out and back. Good, stretch across onto the other side, hand above the head and coming back, opposite side. Sitting down once more on each side. So we're gonna straighten out the left leg, bending on the right, making sure that the knee stays behind the toes and coming back through to the center. Opposite side, and straighten out the left, right leg and back to the center. Turn to the side, reach all the way down. <clears throat> Good, so you wanna make sure that you check the alignment. So move the leg slightly in, drop the heel and straightening out both legs. Keep your head down on your knee. Remember, with this stretch, go as low and as far forward as you possibly can. Feel comfortable moving through the movement. Bend the back leg and the front and come straight up. Open up to the front and to the opposite side. Hold position. Check the alignment, belly button drawn in, back nice and straight. Good. Bring the leg slightly forward, drop the heel, and bring both hands down and both legs straight. Remember, bring your head as close to your knee as you possibly can and feel the stretch through the back of the leg, hamstring, and your calf. Hold your position for four, and three, two, and slowly start to move up, bending the back leg, keeping the front knee bent, arms coming up, Open up to the front and hold. Once again, take a breath. Deep breath in, exhaling out. Coming back in again and feet together. Great team. First exercise, starting off from the side. We're gonna do our plank walkout, but stepping back this time. So we're gonna have our feet wider than shoulders. Reach down, hands to the floor. Starting with the leg that's closest to you. We're gonna go down and we're gonna hold position. So from this position here, what we're gonna be doing is we're going to be moving straight through into a side tap. So I'm going to straight out to the side and bring it back. Straight out to the side and bring it back. Straight out to the side and bring it back. Straight out to the side and bring it back. Now, if you want to, just to change around with a little bit of tempo, you can just one, two, and hold four. Take it out again for two. One, two, hold, and again. If you want to, keep the leg off the floor, and hold, and back. Three more, up, and one, two, and hold. Last two, team, let's go. And one, two, one more, and one, two, and down, and stretch. So the progression is such that when you get to the higher level, you need to ensure that the hips are staying nice and steady and not swaying. Focus on stabilizing through the shoulders and keep your hands nice and firmly on the ground. Once again, coming into a full plank, holding position. So we're gonna tap out, single, and back. Neck nice and lengthened. Shoulders over your fingers, belly button drawn in. Going out and back. Tapping out and back. Tapping out and back. So check your alignment. You don't want to bring your feet too close. Make sure that they are hip distance apart. Tap out and back. Tap out and back. Nice. And stretch it out. Once again, if you're feeling your, your wrists, shoulders a little bit tight, take a little bit of a breather, grab some water and reset. 
moving back into our plank position check your feet check your alignment and going for two taps this time with a hold take it back one two hold and back two more one and two hold and back and again one two hold are you ready for the challenge so we're just going one leg doesn't touch the ground and hold back it is one two back give me one more team one two and hold bring it down child position and stretch it out and hold remember you're not superhuman so if you do need to take a break feel free to take a break stretch out the wrist stretch out the shoulder and stay hydrated great stuff team so we're going to move now into our second position starting off on the plank knees off the ground <clears throat> i'm going to rotate in towards you and i'm going to drive and take my hand up towards the ceiling rotate the hips and come back to the center so i'm going to have my back towards you i'm going to the opposite side coming up and down opposite side rotation lengthen up coming down and again rotate coming up and down team let's do one more on each side so we're going to rotate hold and extension chest open fingers open bring it down opposite side coming up and change now team what i'm going to do i'm going to go back into the same position starting out as i rotate drop the knee and lift up that one leg coming back and i'm back opposite side rotation drop the knee and lift up and back rotation drop the knee come up and lift up one more and coming up rotation drop the knee and lift up and i'm back so i'm just regressing because with our pilates athletic we are able to take it to a whole new level but i want you to be able to see what are the different options that you have in doing this move so you want to make sure that you maintain good balance and back and good form it is challenging but at least if you're able to see the movement regress and then progress and obviously the strength levels will increase the more you get to do it next one guys so still holding the plank position but now this is our push-up you guys know what a push-up looks like and i'm down up and down i'm down checking on my alignment making sure that the shoulders stay behind the fingers coming down inhale in exhale out give me one more inhale exhale out good so you know already that if that's a little bit too challenging you're more than welcome to go into your knees and carry on with the exercise and back up again team let's go two more one inhale exhale come up and down and exhale so my progression going into my push-up notice i'm going to have my hips slightly off the floor toes down and knees onto the floor hands extend up and back and pushing up coming down push it and back out and out and down arms forward and back and up so now you've seen beginner intermediate so taking you up to the next level we're in the full plank position once again we're going to try and keep your hips off the floor chest in chin to the ground so we're going to lower down arms extend and bring it back and breathe out and back down forward and bring it back exhale out two more team and let's go down forward bring it back and up we have one more here we go down chest to the floor exhale out bring it back and exhale out and back strength working with your own body weight 
there are exercises that are going to be quite challenging there are exercises that you'll find pretty easy so it's nice to do a balance of both and in due time stick to the one that you're going to be most comfortable with so my next segment is going to be in a seating position but with my elbows on the floor so with my elbows on the floor what i'm going to do i'm going to start with the leg that's closest to the camera i'm just going to be lifting up and down so my thumb is also a reminder that i've got to really really try and focus on belly button drawn in and lifting the back off the ground and eight seven six five four three two and one now from here what i'm going to be doing now is i'm going to go circle out two three keeping the opposite knee in line with the shoulder and one four circles clockwise and anti-clockwise here we go four and three two and one and down take a bit of a breather knowing very well we're going to put the two together in three two remember chest forward shoulders back and down and lift up two three four circle out one two circle in one two down and up one two three hold circle in out one two out in one two take down one two three hold for four circle in out one two out in one one more team and one two three hold for four circle out one two in out one and two and back wow team changing position changing size so i'm turning so that you guys are able to see both sides with the leg that's closest to you belly button drawn in chest forward and shoulders back and down chin up extend the leg and lifting up and down maintain that the other knee stays in line with the shoulder and up and down six five four three two good team give me another eight flex the foot four three two circle out for two one two three four and circle in and out and four three two and one take a breather so team you know the combination one two three four circle out for two one two in out one two and back one two three hold in out out in down up one two three hold out over in team we have one more down and up one two three hold for four out in one two in out and four coming to a sitting position stretch it forward wow incredible guys make sure that you are breathing drinking water staying hydrated and keeping at your comfortable pace staying with the same position elbows on the ground so what we're going to do now we're going to move into tightening belly button and spine legs extended up and we're going to scissors up and down one two three four bring back and five hold back six seven and back let's lift one two three four bring back five six take it back and lift one two three four bring it in six seven progression going in out one two three four out in one two three four take it back one two three and four last two team one two three four last one one two three and time so if you feel that you need to stretch out a bit nothing wrong just turn the head over towards the side and to the other side you want to make sure that each and every one of the moves count so make sure that you're fully rested you're hydrated stretches you need to and carry on putting the two moves together 
going back into your original position, elbows down, belly button drawn in. Remember the thumb is a reminder, keep your back up nice and tall. So is your chest. Great, so we start off with our scissors. We're going one, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four, and back. One, two, three, and four, and back. One, two, three, four. So we're touching down. Heels don't necessarily have to touch. Coming back in, and one, two. Open up, three, and four, and one, One, two, three, and four. Team, let's do two more. And one, two, three, and four. Last one, one, two, three, and four. Incredible, nice one. So one more before we finish off on this one. Here it is, so we're in a sitting up position. Your hands are tilted, if not slightly to the side. Okay, so you don't want them facing back, but you want them slightly to the side, almost facing forward. So from here, team, we're going to go up into a straight leg, stretch with the hips up, two, three, bring it down, five, seven, stay up nice and tall. So we're gonna go up, one, two, hold, and two, down, lifting up, one, two, hold, down, two, and back. One, two, and hold. Down, three, and back. One more. One, two, and hold. Bring it down, two, and hold. Progressing that movement. So still keeping my hands nice and forward. I'm taking my legs up into a V and down. Up straight into a V and down. Coming down, I'm keeping my legs hip distance apart and switching out and down. Out and down, so we need to avoid any tilting of the head and chest moving forward and back. So we wanna stay up nice and tall, lean slightly back, belly button drawn in, lift up and down, raise up and back, lift up and down, raise up and back, lift up and down, lift up and down, lift up and down, up and down, up and down, lifting up and down. So you'll notice my heels are digging straight into the floor, toes pointed down, contracting the quads and staying strong. So starting off again, we're going up and down, straight lift and back. Up and down, straight lift, up and back. Two more team, up and lift. Last one, up. And down, lift, hold position, and down. <sighs> Round the back, hands over your knees, and stretching out. Holding position for four, and three, and two, and time. Guys, so from here, shift your hips forward, hands in front of you, and standing up nice and tall for the standing series. Stay up nice and comfortable, feet hip distance apart, coming down. So we're gonna hinge through the waistline. All right, hands by the front and holding down. Head nice and lengthened, shoulders down and hold your position. So what I'm gonna do from here, team, I'm going to go leg out, leg back, leg out, coming in, leg out, Coming back, leg front and in. Leg out, half circle back, in and back. In, circle back, in, circle back. In, circle back, in, circle back. So to challenge ourselves now, we're gonna have the same position, hands out to the side, leg off the ground and tap out circle back and drive in come back circle back in and in so we're tapping the inside of the leg come down circle back take it out and in so when i bring it in i raise up slightly 
formal team. So starting off with the leg off the ground, step out, circle back, bring it in, tap in. Circle out, tap back, in, two more. Out, circle back, and, and back. One more, circle out, in, and tap in, and, ow. Whew, I can really feel that. So just to give yourself a nice quick stretch. So you want to hold it down, knee pressed against the floor, toes up, and hold your position. And hold, and back. So now this leg, this is the leg that was working in terms of holding pattern. Now we're gonna give it a bit of a rest and work the other side. Hands at the waistline, side out, circle back, out, and tap in. Out, and back. Remember, shoulders down, head lengthened, as well as the neck, and in. Out, bring it back, and in. Out, bring it back, circle, and in. Last one, team, and back, and, all right, so now it's gonna get a little bit more challenging. You ready? Hinging at the waistline, out, circle back, out, and in. You ready? Leg stays off the ground. Hinging from the waistline, leg lifts up, stabilize, find your focus, tap out, circle back, and tap in. Out, circle back, out, and in. Out, circle back, there, and lengthen up. Side, circle back, take it in, and up one more. Out, circle back, circle in, and time. All right, team, you are doing well. I can see that you are coping. Keep at it, drink some water, stay hydrated. We're almost there in it to win it, ensuring that we are feeling stronger from the inside out. The legs are stretched, we're mobilizing, we're controlling our breathing, and we're able to carry on and move forward. Great stuff. So facing the front, I'm gonna do a hip opener. Back and down. Main focus is to ensure that the hips and shoulders face forward. So I'm coming up, open up, tap, back and in and down. Up, open out, tap, back, in and down. I'm gonna drop slightly. So lift, open, tap, lift, open and down, lift, open, tap, lift, and down, lift, open, tap, lift, open, and down, last one, lift, open, tap, lift, open, and down, changing sides, once again, hinging at the waistline, lean slightly forward, arms opened out, lift, Open, tap, lift, in, and down. Left focus, tap, lift, in, and down. Lift, open, tap, lift, open, and down. Two more, lift, open, tap, lift, open. Team, we have one more, you're almost there. Up, open out, tap, lift, in, and down, the finale, the finale. Let's move into a nice, what we call a narrow squat. Standing up nice and tall, coming down, and down, pulse. So in other words, we're pushing through, raise up, and down. Push resistance, up, and down. Push, push, up and down, push, push, up and down, 
push, push, up and down, push, push, up and down, push, push, up and down, cough raise and push, push, up and down, push, push, up and down, so I'm staying at the same position, push, up and down, push, push, and up and down. Wow, team, shake it out. Job well done, job well done. So proud of you guys, knowing very well that you did your best and you made it look easy, yet it was very, very challenging. Maintain good breathing as we move along through each and every exercise. Work at your pace, ensure that you're able to stay hydrated if you get tired, Take a moment to breathe, 20 to 30 seconds, and join in again. Stretching forward, interlace the hands, stretching it back. Coming all the way over, other side. Stretching forward. Lifting hands up, stretch out the neck. And to the other side. Feet together. So proud of you guys. Inhale, exhale out. One more. Inhale, bring the hands down into prayer position. And I want to say thank you very much, team, for being amazing. It was great working with you on this Pilates Athletic. And I look forward to seeing you in the next workout. Stay tuned.